Hello! <laughs> Alright, this is Zarek, and I'm here to talk to you about a very important multiverses tech that I don't really see very many people, anybody really using, and nobody really talking about. And I don't know why, because it's actually very important for a lot of characters, not just Gizmo, but for Gizmo, it's actually a very, very important, but it's important on a lot of other characters, and I'll demonstrate it a little bit. But that is the fact that you can reverse your attacks specifically your neutral attacks and I'll talk to you about how to do that later but first let's go ahead and demonstrate it so if you jump press attack specifically for, for most uh, for gizmo you're gonna want to hold it and then tap and then when I say tap I mean you want to it's a much it's special reversing and be in attack reversing like in molt in smash ultimate smash ultimate doesn't have attack reversing though they have just special except the for it's so much tighter than in smash ultimate it's much much more tighter so what you're gonna want to do is that right there you just want to jump press the attack and slightly after you press the attack you want to tap the other direction as for the shortest amount of time you can possibly press it because if you press it for any time other than just a frame or two then you lose all that momentum and then after you're done with that then you're going to want to hold the opposite direction so that uh, in the direction you were originally going in all right so let me show you what it looks like when you do it wrong when you do it right because gizmo is a great character to practice this on because it's easy to tell if you're doing it right or wrong so if you're doing it wrong you get this. Mm, that wasn't wrong enough. That was actually still pretty good. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, this is a demonstration when you do it right. That's how it looks like when you do it right. Okay. Now, let me screw up my timing so I start screwing up in matches again. So when you do it wrong, ah, see, I'm doing it right. I'm doing it right. And I could be drifting more like this. You can drift a lot faster. And you can even do a little bit of a dodge like this to get even more distance. And you don't have to do it low to the ground like that. You can actually do it really high to the ground. But there you go. There's when you do it wrong. I finally flubbed it. So when you do it wrong, it's because you're holding left for slightly too wrong. And then you slow down like that. Like this right here. Or even just a little bit of a slow. And then you start to slowly build momentum. But what you want is you want that full drift. So let's go ahead and demonstrate on another character, like say Superman. I don't really play Superman that much, but even Superman is a great character to demonstrate this on because he doesn't have that projectile like Gizmo, but he does still have some useful retreating attacks. So say you're running with Superman, because you're going to end up being pressured at some point eventually in a match, and then you start to move away. But everyone's dodging with Superman, but you don't always have to dodge. What you can do instead is get a retreating aerial like that. You see that? So what happens is, if you're running with Superman, then people are gonna, first people are gonna start trying to space their attacks like that really well. But the moment you start moving away a lot, they're gonna start overextending their attacks, like aiming way past where you are. And if you throw out a reverse aerial like that, where that's your neutral air, you can throw out your side air like that, but if you notice, you have to time it, you might not be able to react properly, it's only one attack. But if you get these re reversed hitboxes like that, where you've got constant hitboxes out behind you, it's a lot more dangerous. And you can do it with your Frost Breath, too. So people are coming at you. It, have you been playing with Superman and you're like, ah, oh, man, I hate using my Frost Breath in neutral because like they just come through me and hit me with it. Well, what if you use it retreating like that? Mm -hmm. So like just about every character can use this and you just basically what you do is go with your character, pick whoever your character is that you like to use, use their neutral attacks and see if it's useful. So Gizmo's neutral attack, this one here, it's not useful because unfortunately when you do this, it stops all your momentum. One way to find out if it's useful is to actually just, before you start trying to reverse it, before you start trying to learn the timing, is just don't try to reverse it, just hold forward and do that. And you see how I lose all my momentum there? But with this, I keep all my momentum? Then there you know. You know that, that that reversing this is nowhere near as useful because you only get a very small amount of spacing. And that still might be useful in really high levels, that little extra micro spacing there. But really, th this attack is so much better to reverse because you get way more distance on whenever you're holding a direction. Like, it doesn't cancel any of your momentum. In fact, 
you can also do this it does cancel your momentum a little bit by the way when you when you do the the dodge jump technique but not all of it you still keep some of it so anyways go ahead and test this out on your character also wait actually one more tip one more tip the the extra tip is that you might find it easier to do if you assign a button to your neutral attacks so uh in the settings you don't have to use my settings by the way but in the settings you have these two options neutral special and neutral attack and that allows you to hold a direction while pressing the neutral and still get a neutral attack so if you want to reverse the neutral because you can't use the right analog stick you have to learn how to special reverse and attack reverse so i hope this is useful to you if you want more tips like this be sure to let me know in the comments section and give me a thumbs up and all that stuff because there's one thing i've noticed is that there's a lot of pros are not really making guide videos they're just making general videos about the game it's not like smash ultimate where smash ultimate that game comes out everybody's making guide videos for all these different techs and all these different things that you can do but no one's really making guide videos on all the different techs you can perform specifically that tech right there you would think everyone would be talking about it because it's so useful for every character just about and it's super useful on characters like gizmo and but it like i said even for someone like superman being able to do those retreating aerials to throw out a hitbox behind you or the retreating uh frost attack like insanely useful insanely useful but yeah i don't know People don't talk about it. So hopefully this helped you a little bit and good luck on your multiverses matches. This is Zirik and I'm out.